Welcome, Mr. Kevin Fu. Cyberspace is a mess. After the breach of 40 million credit cards, Target decided to change its name to Target. <laughs> I'll tell you, times are so bad, even Nigerian princes are complaining about identity theft. <laughs> now, can, can you believe that NSA lost so much top secret data? I mean, have you seen it? But luckily, China has a backup. Uh, oh, it's interesting though, Trump, uh, Trump promised that if he were president, uh, his breaches would be twice as big. Uh, by the way, anyone here, uh, the DNC chairwoman really ought to have a less guessable password than Hillary 2016. <laughs> yeah. Healthcare.gov had a fairly rough start. Um, here's a tip to uh, any feds in the audience. Um, if you want to attract better programmers to the U.S. Digital Service, don't require a digital exam. Um, sorry, sorry, that's a binary joke. Either you get it or you don't. Right. Well, let, let's look back at some of the top computer malware of 2015. Um, you may have heard of some of these. Um, the Chris Christie virus, it reroutes all your internet traffic to Fort Lee, New Jersey. <laughs> uh, the, the Hillary virus uh, deletes the email from your private server. Uh, the Sanders virus just redistributes your data. Uh, oh, and then there's the, uh, the Jeb Bush virus. Uh, it drains your battery till there's no energy left to maintain an election. <laughs> There's the uh, Ted Cruz virus. Uh, it holds your computer hostage until you shut down. Um, uh, there's also the Ben Carson virus, but it just puts your computer to sleep. Uh, and then uh, you can't forget the Obama virus. It promises to change your operating system, but then actually restores Windows 2000. <laughs> And finally, there's, of course, the Trump virus. It compromises your party. <laughs> yeah. Hey, oh, thank you. Change your passwords. Good night. Happy New Year. Yeah. <laughs> I love the